Hi there, my name is Saksham Gupta and today I am making this video to show you my new Android project. This is my first multi-user Android application wherein there are two category of users. One is admin and the other one is student. So admin can basically add new students, new notices and can take disciplinary action against a specific student wherein a student can view his marks attendance notices and the disciplinary action against them also the student can request for outpass permission that request would be sent by an email to the admin i have made this application using java and xml for front end and i have used firebase as my database so let me now just quickly connect my android device with this so let me just install this um, yes so this is the splash screen and these are the features this page appears only once for the first time login then just click on start here we have the login page so here if you see at my database I have only one user that is admin so let me just quickly log in with admin so I entered my email id and my password then just click on login here is the admin page so the admin name and department would fetch from the database and would be displayed here on the screen so now let's add new user let's add me only so yeah Gupta. Hmm, type my role number my email id then my ear and when we click on add user this would create a user and I've coded in such a way that if the year is 3 means if we are using as a third year student so the subjects of third year EC department student would come here along with sub branches as attendance and marks wherein attendance and marks can be stored of for each individual student so let's now add one another user of second year so that we can verify if this is working or not so i've taken the username as devesh and i've added him in second year so when we click on add user the new user is created and here you can see that the subjects here are different from the subjects in third year so these are the subjects of second year student and these also have sub branches similar to the the previous one the attendance and marks So now we have three users, the admin, a second year student and a third year student. So let's add few notices. So I'm writing this notice for testing purpose. So I will name it as notice one. Mm. And one more thing about notice set notices is that when we fetch these notices from the database, this would these would come as the latest on the top so means the first notice would go at the last and the latest notice would appear on the top so let's add multiple notices let me just fast forward this thing so we are adding seven notices uh, let me also yes. show you the how the discipline action works 
so when you click on take discipline action it will demand you for the rule number against whom you have to take a discipline reaction so let's say Devesh was late so we would add his rule number and in activity we would late give late and the action taken against him is uh, let's suspend him for a day so Devesh got suspended for a day for coming late uh, then we will add date so he is suspended on 27 August 2020 take action so this would result in creating a new segment at Devesh database so let me show you in the database here so his database is C this disciplinary action was not there earlier but now it has added and all the status is showing here under his role number so let's now jump to the student profile let me just sign out and sign in again as a student so let's see Devish profile how Devish profile looks like so I have added his mail id and role and password and login so this is how the student dashboard looks like the attendance here the exam score the notice board here you can see the new notices are coming on the, on the top and outpass request so here Devesh could request for an outpass in case he got late if he had earlier requested for an outpass then he would have saved for one day so now what he can do is he can request for an outpass maybe say for 8 to 11 reason mm. will be late due to traffic jam yes so now he could be saved for a suspension hmm. anyhow this is this was just an example to show how this works so just add the reason date and timing from and to and then when you click on send request it will prompt you to choose an email client then we click on gmail it will automatically fill all the details and you just have to click on send button and the email would be sent to the admin now let's see discipline action taken against him mm, late this thing with that we have added on clicking these three lines this would prompt the developers profile and here you can contact and give your feedback or reviews about your application so whatever you feel like you can send via email <laughs> awesome for now so send this okay now let's log out and log in with a third year student So let me just quickly add details, the password and let's click on login. So here you can see my details are coming, a third year student so the subjects and all everything are coming according to year. Notices are common to every user, out was the same way and there was no disciplinary action against me so nothing here well let's now try and update attendance in the database so let me just close this one and open my database 
so this roll number let's add say for example CUI attendance present count updated by one enter got updated and working days let's also update this by one mm, sorry um, let me just go back mm, update it got updated and here you can see the percentage is also calculated accordingly let's also try adding marks in, in it 15 on 20 so it got updated on the app so this was all for today and i hope you guys like this video if so then do hit the like and subscribe button thank you for watching have a nice day